your daily hour with Yeah. Hey everybody. Whoa. Whoa, we're freaking out a bit. It's Ooh. the program. Solar flares, maybe. We're on TV. Here we are once again. Once a day, every day. We turn on the machines and then we start talking. Uh, I'm not sure what's going on. We just moved around, so. Whoa. Some weird, we're having some weird. Keep. That, that's is that, is that doing yeah, keep it? doing it. Hold it down. I think it's fixing. Mm -hmm. I kind of like that. Yeah. Personally. It's, uh, oh, look at that. There we go. It's for Saturday today. And we're on TV <laughs> once again, for once a day. Saturday. Every day we turn on the machines and we start talking. We're back in the basement. Hi. Reed. Yeah. Hello. How are you doing today? I'm doing good. Oh, good. I'm to be on. You're back. It's been a while. It's been years, maybe. I don't think it's been a year. I think I got on it. It's been a, about maybe half a year. I think uh -huh. I came on with, uh, I don't know who I am. I think in the summer. Was it Lewis's party? No. Uh, no, you wasn't there for that. No. Was Lewis's going away party or something? Yeah, we had a going away barbecue. Oh, yeah. That was, That's it was a while ago. That was in the summer. I remember we had a pool outside. Yeah. Why so many rings, Kenny? Are you just starting to wear? Uh, I, I didn't for fun. Cool. There's no reason. Express yourself. Yeah. I, I don't know what kind of reasons. I don't know what, what reasons one would even have. Like, what's the, what's the purpose, really? Maybe each means something. Oh, yeah. You. Like, one represents love. Another represents fear. Fear, fear and love. And another one is hopes and dreams. And you, have you, memories of yeah. difficult experiences. Each ring is a memory, yeah. Uh, have you seen anything on the streets there, Reed? Uh, not really. Um, rain. Mm. Jokes aside. It's, Today. Uh, yeah, very cold outside. It was, it was a pouring down rain. Mm -hmm. Yesterday we uh, did we that uh, that art show thing. What was it called? the love thing? And we have lots of this confessional booth stuff. Mm, well, we're looking at some that. of that stuff. We can take a peek at it. Maybe we'll look mm -hmm. a yeah. some of it. See if I got it going I correctly. I also have some footage from yesterday too. Oh yeah. Yeah, a few uh, of the art exhibits. Oh, I hear it. There it is. Here. You mean like oh, the, the this is where we tenants? Yeah. This is where we left oh. off from yesterday. Yeah. Uh, not yet. Yeah. Like We're going to be doing a thing. You want to display? Did you see this downstairs, Reed? Did you ever check it out? No, I saw it. It was like an interview booth. I didn't really know what was going on. I didn't see you in it. I thought it was like a project or something. Huh? Really I was in there a little bit. Uh -huh. It was the, the TV booth. Oh, you, you're on TV a lot though, aren't you? Mean mm. Oh, you just, I don't no, think I so. Just, just facilitate. Because I always do this. Yeah, that, that's Andrew, so we're... But your TV, your TV person. This is a photo. <laughs> Mini photos. Yeah. Mm, what happened there? It's the, uh, oh, I, I pressed stop. Oh. It's the end of President's Week this week. So, uh, today is the end of President's Week, and we're going to be moving into Convenience Week. So, we have about 25 minutes left in President's Week, and then we're going to be moving into Convenience Week. I've been saying, who's your favorite president? That's what I've been asking people to re read. Favorite, favorite, favorite president? president? Yeah. Uh, I would have to say, you know, the classic Abraham Lincoln. Lincoln. Probably the most, from what I gather, of my lack of historical knowledge. The nicest... Most honest, most justifiable, most Aryanan, most played, most vain president uh, that American history has had. Um, I think he's one of the ones that his American narrative actually might have stood up. I think he's a pretty good guy. 
Yeah, lots of statues and stuff. And yeah. Pennies. I saw the Lincoln movie. Oh yeah, I didn't see that. And it was good. I thought it. W- I thought it was going to be more heroic. It was mm-hmm. kind of subtle. It was kind of about the bureaucracy of democracy. But yeah, I would say Lincoln. That's a good answer. I don't think anybody said that one yet. Really? What they do? He's like the superhero of presidents. I think so. People have been said Washington. We've heard lots oh, of water. Oh God, man, Washington. I mean, he's Carter, the first one. People, Carter, Carter, Truman. Yeah. Oh, uh, well, Kennedy. Ken- eh, yeah, those are good ones. Washington is. Uh, he didn't want to be president. This yeah, first a time villain too. to a certain degree. Yeah, I don't really know much about him. I think people are just saying him because he's the, the our general. state's namesake here. Uh, if I could be so bold, this is going to be a little bit of a uh, shout out to my friend who watches uh, this show often, loves it, uh, Kenny. Hey, loves thanks, the show. thanks, Tuna. Tuna. <laughs> hey, shout, shout out, out, shout Thank out to you, Tuna. tuna. A big, big fan of the program and all the wonderful people and artists. So that's for you and the respect and love that you have for this show. Tuna, we appreciate your viewership. We'll probably leave that thing up there. <laughs> oh, she would be honored. Uh, or he. Yes. That's a... Uh, reminds me of... The, no, Thank you, the main Tuna. Office, they call him Tuna. <laughs> Thank you, Reed. How many do you think you have... How many daily... How many consistent viewers on a day do you think you guys have? Well, they say, this is a statistic that I heard, is that only 2% of the people who watch shows participate in calls. And if that statistic, going by that statistic, we get about, you know, six messages a day. And that, I mean, that makes it 1,200. That seems a little high. Six but times 50? No, they say they say 200. So it's 200. It's like 300, right? Wait, it's two. They say two per two percent of, of people watch it. Mm-hmm. So that's. But you got to include yourself, right, and your guests in studio guests. No, well, it's just based on the phone calls. The phone calls. So if so we get two, that's we it's multiply. It's hard to do that. What does that mean? I mean, we multiply it by. That's really difficult. I know. I want to because what is what is two percent? Yeah. So that's let's just go by 100. Two percent, it's 300. Because two percent of 100 is two, and then you do 300, mm-hmm. would be six. But I don't know. To be truth be told, as as much as this show is this show, I'd be surprised if 300 people are daily watching the show. Yeah, maybe maybe flipping through and seeing it at least. But oh, maybe they've seen. Oh, certainly, but like consistently. Consistent I'm viewers. I'm gonna watch like my daily hour. Oh, uh, enough to watch it five times a week. The ones, I n- I know I'm pretty sure Robin, if you're out there, uh, I think I think Robin watches the show often, and uh, John Webster watches almost every day too. So yeah. that's at least two that I know of <laughs> that are. Nobody's consistent. gonna watch it. The thing seven is, days I think I think nobody's gonna do that. Well, some people right, some people watch TV all the time, but I think uh, the <laughs> I think a big thing is that. People who are watching the show, they, they don't want to call. You know, TV is kind of a passive medium. We're never going to know. And, uh, yeah. So you know What's really fun about this show, among many things, is uh-huh. you can see your face. Yeah. You try, to, try to make a, like a, I bet you could do it really well, Ernest. Uh, can you guys make a, try uh. to make your fun, like, funnest face? Like. Uh, ah. Yeah. Watch ourselves on the TV <laughs> over there. So, oh, I, I, speaking of that, I should Whoa. probably get that, that other camera going too under dice cameras over there. Do you, do I can't see? do it without the uh, sound, sound effects. Yes. Wow! Yeah. You see uh, um, do you, that that dice camera over there, Bird? We're gonna we get it going here as we can we can show the TV that we're looking at. We also got some messages and stuff, and we didn't get to check any messages yesterday. We're gonna be moving into convenience week in here. 25 minutes and I'm still really not very sure what convenience week is going to be all about. I, don't, oh, I wonder if we ever... There was, a prior there was already a convenience week? No. We talked about probably this, the one that we're doing soon. What are the 52 weeks? Can you name some other? What other weeks, weeks have yeah. we been doing? Yeah. Oh uh, yeah, we. I don't know if we weren't. We were not doing the weeks thing since you've been here. 
Uh, no, I have Yeah, it looks like we had, uh, yeah, last week was Love Week, and on our Valentine's Day, we did a... Oh, oh, they're not nationally sanctioned? Like, sometimes they actually have, like, secretary, you know, there's, like, actually... Oh, uh, like, yeah, if... You guys made them up this week, like, each week? Yeah, yeah. We're making them up, but we're basing a lot of them off of holidays, if there's a holiday, oh, like, cool. President's Day and Valentine's well, Day. How'd you come up with Convenience Week? Uh, well, the th I was just calling, we were trying to think of weeks, and there's no holidays there in the next week. And convenience, I was calling a lot of convenience stores, and I uh, see uh, the word convenience written on the... Oh, 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 oh. oh it's okay. Um, mm, they're right there, see? I don't know if you can see the word convenience is written on this table. Oh, okay. So I was like, hey, convenience, right? I like convenience. It's some, something people like to have, and... I don't know. It's kind of a weird week, and I, as we were get, getting closer, I've been wondering what, what it is. Yeah, what, what it is. What it is. Yeah. What, so we don't even know. Maybe convenience stores. I mean, I think everybody. I would say almost everybody, unless you're like. A, you want to call not mobile li has experiences with convenience stores. So. Oh, without a doubt. Yeah. You want to call Dan? It's probably Dobler. Dobler. It's yeah. getting late to late, but I think we should call yeah, so him. Maybe, I, don't, I think you. I think he'd be up. He. It's. It's. He. He goes to bed kind of whenever it feels like. I guess. Bird. We need to get a eighth to eighth cable. You know what that is? Like a headphone jack cable thing over there. Is it? Can you see? For the computer, so we can make a phone call. You. Are uh, you plugging in your thing? Oh. Uh, oh. A dice cam. The the dice. Uh. Yeah. Here we go. Did, uh, I think dice. This might not be long enough, actually. Dice. Uh, the dice game went off, so we're gonna play the dice game. That works. Uh, here we go. Let's, let's get the pens out. We're gonna write a number down in our hands. We're gonna try to visualize the future here. Play the dice game. Oh, I think the. Oh, this is going. Can you say hi on this thing? Oh, you did great. Thank you. Um. Uh, I did. Yeah. Uh oh, Heather's mic's not on. Hi. A little bit. What did I say? I think we, I said that the show is based on about love and stuff. So I'm like, oh, what do I say about that? You know, it's pretty heavy. And then we talked about a Selena song, just kind of repeating other things. I'm gonna talk to somebody. Is there anybody on the other side of this curtain? Why don't you want to talk to me? Oh, oh she was hi, not saying hi, anything. That was a trick. Oh. Yeah, we're here just over there. How are you doing, he Heather? We, we haven't seen you. Oh, I'm uh oh. So, if you park, if you park, you know. Alright, that was it. Mr. Ginsu message, sound tester. Here, let's call Dan Dobler. No, I think he's talking about, um. Loose change. People were throwing money at you. Did anybody get that money? I don't think so. It just ended up in the street. I, Somebody's I saw gonna. Some yeah. Some grabbers or change in the streets. Oh, you did. Some people are gonna have. Somebody is gonna have a good it's day tomorrow. To pick it up. Yeah. Tomorrow, somebody's gonna walk down the street and they're gonna find like three dollars probably. Yeah, Ooh, was there that much thrown? I think so. I mean, there was. There people were throwing change quarters. Time. Wow. Possibly three dollars. Cool, cool sound effect. Oh damn. <laughs> Dandy. Yeah, see if he's gonna answer. I don't know. Yeah. Maybe sleeping. His voicemail is probably still filled up. Oh yeah, we filled it up. Mm. Yeah, I don't think he listens to the messages. No, he doesn't. He doesn't know how to use it. So. Yeah. Well, he's up. We fill in the messages. We were doing. I've been calling them ghost messages, where we leave down a message, but he's never gonna listen to it. It's but we're leaving it anyway. Time. Should we roll that dice? Oh uh, yeah. Three digits. Pick a number. Oh, oh, uh, I also need a number. How many dice is it rolled? Six, dice six total. Of the show uh, here. One and then two and then three on the third roll. So, one, 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 so, one, one, 
through six. I think you should be able some, to choose any number some, one through thirty-six. Well, yeah, what if you get the perfect one? Mm -hmm. Double bonus. If yeah. you want to, I guess. Yeah. If you want to, um. You want to. You if you want to. That leap of faith. If you want to take it. the leap of faith and like just pick a random kind of number and you think that the dice are going to add up to it, and if you they do, I guess you could win. That sounds like yeah, a good new thing. Yeah, that's a pretty wild thing. That would be a very difficult. Yeah, you have to really hone into reality and hold on to everything. Whoever gets that is on a pretty good path. Yeah, I would be amazed. Do we have the? Maybe I want to know what a dream is. Do you ever, do you ever sing, Ernest? Yes. What's your, like, go-to singing voice? Uh, I don't know. Well, what if, like, God came down and said, you need to sing? I am singing. Yeah. See, it's it's hard like to do it. It's hard to do it on camera. camera. Yeah, yeah. Really? Why? Yeah, I don't know. I'm nervous. Yeah, well, singing's, yeah. singing's a challenge. Yeah, I, I guess, you know... This is mine's a fake, like, cause I wanna know, cause now I'm singing the song. It's fake. Yeah. I don't think it's fake. It's close. It's it's intended to be kind of humorous, cause it's I have a pretty I bad think voice. That camera might be kind of toasted. The, the focus mechanism messed up last time. <clears throat> Probably the wire. I think it's more likely that's this wire. Trying to get this camera going here, viewers. So change it to the black one. Yeah. Right yeah, it's kind of a long cable there. This, this is kind of a dull part of the program. Oh wow, the focuser is fixed. This is the That's TV. Great. You can see your face on it. See. Um, should 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 I roll it? Yeah, sure. Go for it. Should I roll here it? Here it goes. <laughs> there it is. So that's a five. I it's lost. a five. Five alive. I lost. Did you win, Reed? I had a four. I have a one. Well, valiant effort. You win, Bird? I had a three. So who are your, some of your freaking callers? You got a Yeah, let's check Gitsu. it out. Oh, are you getting, oh, what was the Squirrel Meadow thing? Was he on it? Uh, Yeah, mm. he did. Uh, DJ'd. He's got a commercial, too. The last dance of dance. Yes. Yeah, so the commercial is going to be coming You'll up in about... That. Uh, 20 mm. minutes here. Is our commercial still on? No, I sort of, you know, uh, yeah. Anyway, we didn't it, we didn't get it back in. Special. We can yeah we can try to work it back into the rotation. Uh, I think I, it, it had a good run. It I, did. Yeah. We, we're, it was going for almost yeah. a year. I, so. I think we should do another one. Yeah. One, well, know, where's Carl? Else. He's around. Carl's too. around. Maybe yeah. We can call he might him. be available. To him. I'm sure yeah, he'd be uh, happy to share from you. Give him a call. Shock to the heart, cause you're too late. You give love a bad name. <laughs> That's pretty. That was a horrible Bon Jovi. I'm sitting down, so I can't use my diaphragm. Yeah, yeah that was pretty. I, that was not that no, good. No, that was great. You, you brought it home at the end there. That's for sure. Mm. Um, yeah, I like the idea of doing a Bon Jovi music video promo. You know, sort of like I, I, you know, we got, need to think of a special product or service or non-special maybe just a you know yeah something. uh here, here's maybe mr ginsu you know it must gonna be get about windier than motherfucking hell over here like a dream phone or whatever fucking, i just heard that yeah. radio some motherfucker the last come on there that mm. park your car into the wind so yeah. If you park, cause if you park way in the wind, you fucking, uh, with your back to the wind, you will have your car to swung the fuck open, and it will hit mm. someone, mm. or bend your hinges. So much wind, yeah. Or fucking something like that. So much wind that is causing we'll problems. Yeah, car. we gotta call him Holy back and fuck. see if he, his door hit um, somebody. <laughs> what the fuck? So he'll talk to you Um, I don't even know what to say about that. Why no, Mr. Gensu is. We don't know what it looks like. Hey, man, it's not his real name. Just fuck, quit doing that. I want to know his real name. I wouldn't have fucking known. I can't even remember who the fuck he was. Fucking. He never said his real name. Or ever. Yeah, commercial. No. Commercial. I thought for something. I know. I don't want to know. Six, it's five. 
Too magical, oh. you should know. Three. Two. Oh, it's info time. Now it's info time. Answer some frequently asked questions about the program you're watching it right now. It's called Your Daily Hour with me. It's a call on television talk show. It's taped right here in Thurston County. Every day, it's during its 65 days a year, seven days a week, during its 65 days a year. It airs every night at 11.30 p.m. TCT Channel 22, each episode airs a week after it's taped. So if you're watching on TV at 11.30 p.m., this episode taped the week, same weekday of the previous week. If you are watching at 2 a.m., this episode taped the same weekday of the previous month, previous year, you no can... Way. You can also watch any episode of the program YouTube.com. Anybody can be on the program, especially you, YDH. Remember, realize on the community for content, so give us a call at 360-836-4384. Leave a message. We'll call you back in the next episode. Thank you for watching. And now back to the program. Your daily hour. What do you think about the program? Yeah, get any... Uh what do they think? They are supportive. Well, I don't know yeah. if they're supportive, but they're. Uh, I think they're supportive by being hands off and saying that the producers of the program, they don't have. You know, people call, people have called TCTV and said, like, I'm hearing some Complaints. cursing and yeah. and some things I don't agree with, and the staff at TCTV says, you know, we're not in control of what our um, it's members. It's legal, man. It's legit. Yeah, so they they are hands yeah. off. They let us do it, and it, they're it's need to be supportive, and they're letting us use use it. And I think I think that they're probably happy that we're using the facilities. You know, you guys at home, if you're watching this, we're just people in town. You know, we're not like uh, we're not like big shot movie producers or TV people or anything. We just went down to TCTV. It's 440 Yager Way uh, on the west side of Olympia. Here, you just go there and you say. I want to be on TV. I want my mm -hmm. own show. You can call this mm -hmm. show. You can get on this show too. It's kind of easier, probably. Like Kevin, Kevin Costner in Field of Dreams. What? If you build it, they will come. Yeah. So you want to make your own show? Go down to TC TV. <laughs> there, they're, they seem pretty nice about it. I think uh, they're happy about it. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I was there today, and, uh -huh. and someone said, you know. That's great about the program. Keep it up. They you told know. you about. They oh, that's yeah. awesome. Yeah. They just said that they like. Well, it they or? said they, they. I don't know. It's kind of embarrassing, but the person specifically thanked me for supporting the program. Well, that's so, great. Yeah. Was it? Yeah. Freddy? No. You know what's a really interesting <laughs> movie? Speaking of Kevin Costner, the last Mohican. What was the movie? Uh, was the last of the Mohicans. Last of the Mohicans is that guy? I think he is a. Cowboy, or he's a white spiritual person, or is he? An, is he a Native American? The movie always confused me. Is I think he is a Native American. I think he is the last he, Mohican. He's can. playing a Native American. I think he. Pl oh, he plays in it. Oh, okay, I thought he was like kind of adapted into the. Or does he play a Native American? Oh, I don't know. Is he? I think he plays a Native American. I think he plays a Native American, and saves the day. And it won it won a Grammy, if I recall. A Grammy. Yeah, and it has a big uh, love song in it. That was a hit. I forgot. There's a lot of these movies. That's that sounds like the Last Samurai, to me. And this oh, the is Tom like, Cruise one. Yeah, this yeah. is like white white guy goes to the cultural place, and then becomes the last of them. Mm -hmm. And it's like, hey, how come there's so many, you know, Japanese samurais or Native American Mohicans? And then, you know, Kevin Costner or, uh, what's his name, uh, Keanu Reeves, they're the best. Yeah, I think, you Tom, I think Tom Cruise might have been. Oh, uh, was it Tom, Keanu? Tom, oh, Tom, or Tom Cruise, Last Samurai, right? Uh-huh. But I think, what was Keanu yeah, Reeves? Kevin Reeves, yeah, that movie just came out. Had another, like, kind of yeah, yeah. similar, like, being the best, like, defeating, you know, the entire mm -hmm. race races, uh, thing. Mm-hmm. Mm. Yeah. You're so. talking about, uh... The blue people? No, so Avatar. That's yeah. the exact same thing, too. Yeah. It happens making that movies. money. Getting that, uh, you know, making that money. Looks like Dan Dobler left us a message. Nope. I think something went wrong with the thing before, so maybe we'll try to call him one more time, too. Hey, Dan. Hey, Dan. How you doing? Good. Uh, I'm doing okay. Yeah. I got a new book, and, and, and uh, 
Uh, I'm gonna take it easy tonight. Take oh, it good. Easy, you know? Yeah. He's coming back by. All right, here. I, I think the phone. I think it didn't night. go through correctly because it didn't go to his voicemail. So let's try to call him one more time. Mm-hmm. Um. You got a new book. I got a book called Clueless by Stephen King. He showed it to me. Uh, oh, it wasn't Clueless. It was another one. Oh, Stephen Shining. King. Yeah, no, this is a new one, I think. Mm. I mean, he showed it to me today. You saw him today. I saw him today. Oh, yeah. Oh, I wish he picks up. That would be so glorious. I don't know what's going on, what was going on before, but we, if it doesn't go to voicemail, then something's gone wrong with the phone system. Did you see him today? Yeah. Oh, here it is. And Dobler. That's a new one. It's full. We should, uh... We went to Goodwill. Commercial with Dan. Oh, that would be amazing. That's a great idea. Mm-hmm. <laughs> wow. You know what's amazing about that commercial, too? You ran it up right on the spot. You didn't. We didn't spend two weeks, oh, four no. hours a day... That was Going a, over that was that. two hours. I yeah. think we. I mean, we did. We spent about an hour on it, and then I think that was one of my faster editing jobs. It took me about a half an hour because we were pretty precise on the cuts that we did. So I, just I like it that in was there. a good one. I knew exactly what I wanted to do with it, and you gave me good advice with the music and the you know sound effects and stuff. Where's Jennifer these I think days? That was uh, Freddie helped with that. Jennifer. Uh, she was there too. Is uh, maybe her name's not Jennifer? I don't think it is. Carl's friend? Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, around. Jennifer. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. She she's ever on the program? She, uh, she has never been on the program. I think she uh, maybe has a bit of anxiety about you know just speaking public, kind of public speaking. Uh -huh. It's a little, it's a little bit public speaking. People think it's more public speaking than it is because there's nobody there actually, but we're kind of speaking to the public. Well, mm. it's also recorded, you know. Mm -hmm. The if it wasn't on YouTube, it would be kind of another thing too. Yeah, I mean, people might be able to buy copies from TCTV as well, but mm. depending. Well, I think YouTube is fun. Carl, Carl is uh, hanging out with Jennifer and helping her out, and it's like he came into my thing the other day. What was oh. your thing? Your thing? The, or the, he came into my work the other day. I saw oh. him at work. Great. How long is cool. your commute? Uh, it takes about an hour on the bus. Oh my! Wow! Yeah. Do you read on the bus? I um, listen to music and I have a, a game. I have a, a PSP console. Yeah, so I play Do you video games. Um, you know, I, I was watching uh, on YouTube and I saw the one with you and your uh, siblings, Kenny. Uh huh. That was a great one. Yeah, was that Christmas? The recent one? Or? Yeah, it wasn't here though. It might not have been. It, it was in like the attic, I believe. Oh okay. Of this house? Uh, that was the attic uh, the, at another place. Oh, okay. Yeah, that that's a good one. I like the, my family ones there. Yeah. They're nice. Yeah, you see anything on the streets? You know what I found on the street today? In the midst of just concrete and uh, trash, uh -huh. I found one um, rose petal. Wow. So then I went and I got a love spell. Solitary... We'll call it, it's pink. Rose petal. See, I, I was talking I to her. I found one rose petal, which is now in this love spell, which is now infusing this rose mm. with love. Ooh, extra love. Oh, oh is it, are you doing the thing where it sucks up the color from the, for the plant? Sucks, how up, it does? sucks up the love. Yeah, it's love, color, love, color. Love <laughs> we're something? talking about oh, you, you put the pink, oh, dye the uh, pink roses too. Yeah, Somebody else was yeah, we're talking about like the level, the, levels of love and roses. I guess there's levels because it's like. Yellow is like your friend, and then it's like white is like next level love, and then red is like heavy love. Pink. Yeah, whereas pink? all the colors of roses are black. Black is coded. What we decided is goth, goth love. love. Goth love. You say like mm. I goth love you. Yeah, I think pink. <laughs> I think heavy pink friendship. Is like heavy friend love. Yeah. Like, see. Oh, heavy friend love. Maybe. Extra. I what yeah. I was saying the other day. Oh, there you go. Pink can almost be platonic. You know? So that's a uh, you can. Well, uh, yeah, heavy all friend your love. That's is that platonic? Heavy, or? Yeah. Heavy, yeah. heavy yeah. friend. Yeah, like non-sexual. <laughs> You're my heavy friend. <laughs> uh, it's flipping out a bit. I don't know what's going on. Did you see friend. any of this, the stuff that's happened so I think far? It's okay. Like we well, listened to an album, an R&B album. Did that? Oh, the. I'm fast forward a little bit. I think there's a lot of stuff. Um. Yeah. So maybe we'll take a look at some of the stuff. Usually, we have. Like, 
the contest. Oh, halfway through the program. Another thing, too. Here it goes. <laughs> uh, we're going to play the next dice game here. Do you always have certain rituals? Like, do you always do that dice move? Uh, it's it's not, uh, not, a, not a given. Like, yeah, I, I like to do that thing though. It looks beautiful. It feels like, and I it makes me feel like I'm, like a, I have a power. It's yeah. Like, oh, I'm summoning the dice because you know it's coming. And it's like, wow, here comes the dice. Yeah. Cast. Yeah. Here we go. We're gonna roll two dice this time. Wants to uh, you want to roll, Reed? Yeah. Here we go. Hey, lucky. Roll em, roll em. There's actually ways to modify the dice, and roll I'm going to do it. You have Two fours. Oh, oh one four. Oh. Oh. Ooh. You have 500 points. Two, four, five. Uh, Bird, you got any points? Zero points. What Me was neither. Yours? Six. Three. Three. I'm a one. Uh, you're winning. You have 500 points. Yep. But it's still anybody's game. We can still come back. Yeah. A couple th games ago, I got two of the number I chose on the last row. Oh, that's great. Doubles. That's great. Yeah. Are you are you setting up your camera, Bird, so we can look, you know, look at some yes. of the stuff from yesterday? Yeah. I guess we can... When does the commercial come on? I'd love to see... Uh, it's going to be on uh, in about five minutes here. Or, I mean, because ten minutes. Gonna be usually... That's always how it works. Yeah, but you, you, usually it's like the sh I, I press record on the thing. We can wait go until off after and then it goes for the hour. Yeah. And that's it. Yeah. But this time well, I'm like pausing set up. and like talking, yeah. and going hard, coming back, talking to people, and and then later on tonight we're gonna be watching it again. So we're gonna be like reviewing all the stuff. Maybe fast. Other in the house. Who knows? Maybe also. I think you should put if all I don't of have this onto do, we'll YouTube. Go back to this stuff. Mm -hmm. I'm actually having a really good time right now in this. I, I'm. I'm thinking I could like do the show. I'm, I'm like right now. I'm, I right here? yeah. I mean yeah. I could do the right show in a here, smaller like space where we're like bigger. A five by five space. It's, it's yeah, we're see, like, oh, we're yeah, zoomed yeah. in. Like back here, we're like yeah. taking like, up a very small like amount of the space. Shower, it's like this one. Thing. I mean, I don't want to. Yeah. Like, yeah. Like the I don't know. What, I don't know. What do you What do you like better? What do you think? I like that intimate up close look there. I also kind of like though that there's. It looks like a void where it's like this. Like it's very cable access. You know where this is. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, you want to hold them up to the camera? I like camera? the space. Mm -hmm. Is it? Is that? I don't know. I, I, it's public yeah, access. I feel like I want to do uh, both. I really like this confessional booth thing. I feel like maybe you don't have one to of these days I'm going to go downtown uh, and set up a, a five by five booth it's and art. just sit in there art, you know? and see if I can yeah. get yeah. people in there. For arts walk. Oh, we that's a good that. one. Great yeah. idea. Wow. Have the YDHWN. Yeah, maybe we can get that going. That's what's in April. Yeah, April 25th. Yeah, there's rules and Let's stuff, get a nobody spot. Cares. Nobody's, yeah. There's like no sensors or anything. <clears throat> the only thing that could happen is somebody could call in. Oh, Heather's going to show us away. some nude photos. All right. We're gonna That's really? what she yeah. said, yeah. Oh, you get off, your, off your phone. She wanted to show. She volunteered. Yeah, I didn't. No, I can just. This is where the nudes are. Valentine's. Yeah, it's Valentine's. Oh, yeah. So. I just like, I'm like. Here's you? some uh, nudity. <laughs> My butt is here. And so <laughs> is this, this like camera. tiny that's a, I think that's, that what? that's uh, a thing that's happening with the, in the world. <laughs> you can take pictures because when you're naked Anything and you, you have a phone, get, sometimes oh, you think, sizes, or you have a camera, a thing on your phone, you, you think, I could take pictures of Wait, this. What's oh, on your hat, Well, I guess you're going to uh, It's like too. some kind of army stuff. This is my uh, grandfather's right, hat. Ooh, he uh, was in the military. Aerospace that's what medicine? medicine? Aerospace Squadron? Cool. Was he in the military his whole life? Uh, but yeah, I guess so, yeah. He was in World War II. Is he still alive? He is not. He died about six, see, you say six hi? seven years ago now. Well, he must have been alive for a while if he was in World War II. It's he was. Old. He, I mean, he was in his 70s, late 70s when he died. Did he live in Washington? He did, yeah. yeah. yeah so Born and raised? Do it. Uh, yeah, yeah. Is all your family here? My family is... Here it is. Here it is. Oh. Well, actually... Most like of my family is. You. Oh, there it is. You got a snake That's kind of nude. Oh, yeah. Is it a is snake? It photoshopped? I, a, I don't know. It's a selfie. It's like your so butt. Taking a picture from your butt. Wearing a bikini. It's a butt yeah. photo. Um, my family is got estranged a few generations ago. So it's kind of my grandfather and my uh, grandmother. Uh, they were estranged, right. and then my other grandmother. Str there like divorced? No, like uh, there here's oh, some nudity. That. That's the nude. That's the real nude. Um, you gonna pause that? My uh, 
<laughs> my, I think my ma my grandmother and grandfather on my father's side. Uh, okay. Uh, hey, they you, were Japanese. You. My grandmother is from Japan, and my my That's grandfather uh, is an American it's, 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 uh, in uh, the war. Mm -hmm. And it's, I think maybe there was some kind of family conflict there. In honor of President. So I don't really know them too well. Day for us. And so on my other side, my too. grandparents, my of my mom's grandparents, are will immigrants. You, will you talk to somebody else? Hey. So my family is pretty small. If I get somebody else, can you talk to them? But they're all Washington, the ones that I know of. So how many are alive now in Washington? How many alive family members do I have? In Washington. Um. Because your brother and sister. I got my brother there. and sister, and my mom and dad. Where and are they from? Where Where are they all from? Well, yeah. What well, No. Where? What town are they living in? Um, they they all live around here. My well, here my brother right and sister now? are off at it's school. My sister uh, is in. Uh, is it Valentine's Day? Bellevue. What? Who the fuck is Valentine? Oh, th this is what I left. This, this stuff I don't know about. Is that okay? okay. <laughs> Wasn't Valentine a um, saint? Saint Valentine. Valentine. Yeah, maybe we'll get back to some more of this. Oh, I don't know. Uh, let's see. So my 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 father lives in Tumwater somewhere. If you're watching, hi, Dad. My mother lives in Olympia. Um, ooh, look at this, yeah. This my brother is, is out is the there in college, and my sister's out there in college also. And I have one grandmother who lives in Lacey who sometimes watches the show. Hi, grandmother, if you're watching the show. But she usually... What? Where does your sister live? Bellevue. And She's your going, brother where? Uh, Central, which is... What's Ellensburg? Ellensburg. Ooh, look at that! What is yeah. he doing in Ellensburg? I think he's doing pizza stuff right now. He, I think he's gra either graduated or about to graduate from college, and he's making pizzas. What he study? There. I think he's I an English major. Oh, he's gonna be a teacher or something? Yeah, I don't know what he's gonna do as an English major. I don't think he's gonna be a teacher. He doesn't seem like a teacher to me. Does but he study? Does he write or does he study literature? I don't, I don't really know what he does. It doesn't. He never. He was never in. It's kind of. He was never into any of that kind of stuff, but now he uh, he seems to be. Is this a video you made? Into it, yeah, it's a bird's video. Ooh. Snow from a week ago. Oh, beautiful. Last week. Yep. Damn. Yeah. How much snow did you guys get? Uh, a few inches. Yeah, it was like three, three or four. Oh, you use a camera? You use like your handheld camera? Yeah. Capital Lodge is fifteen king of. Knights of Pythias. Oh, Knights of Pythias. That's a Freemason, I think. Mm -hmm. You just make this? Like, you just made this for this the movie? This is last week. I was at the... I went to the governor's office last week <coughs> with a lady from north of Seattle who wrote a petition to ban fracking in Washington State. Huh. So... Hey, yeah, that's it was, uh, nice. That's the whale, 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 whale made, made out, out of garbage? Plastic. Uh, one was done in Olympia, but this one is from uh, Bremerton. Yeah. I yeah. saw though they had that at the procession. Yeah, it was beautiful. Mm -hmm. It was a lot bigger too than that. I think the one. At I think you're right. This yeah. is in the Capitol building, huh? This is an umbrella that was blown out by the wind. I kind of want to go on a tour of the Capitol. I used to go on those tours when people. Here's the show last night. Kenny throwing gang signs. Looks like yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah the tour of the Capitol is amazing. Yeah. Some really interesting facts. I'm dancing around. Bird's got the camera on me. Can I tell you a historical fact about the Capitol, actually? Oh, this is your... That's your thing. Yeah. Right? Oh, yeah. yeah. So... Uh, I won't tell the story. I'll tell it really quick. To get that marble was in Italy. They went over there for whatever reason. They weren't, weren't even going to get the marble. There was so much marble that you need to put it to, like, create a home... Uh, for it to be safe in the boat, to make the boat go, essentially. Uh, so they brought it back to New York, and they're like, what are we going to do with this marble? And people from Washington were like, oh, man, we'll take all that marble for free. And the people from New York are like, all right, take it. So that's how they made, that's how they got all that marble. It's a lot of, they did tra yeah. trains or what? Yeah, I would assume. What is this? What is Oh, here's some this color, yeah. One of the art oh, exhibits oh. from last I'm trying to get the color go. There you have any go. of the... Ooh, ooh, yeah, you hit it. Do you have any of the performances on it? I have a little bit of yours, yeah. Do you have any other ones? No, nope, uh. but Luke got a bunch of them. We could check out some of it, yeah. I was mostly dwelling in the basement. 
Oh, Luke, yeah, okay. Mm. Oh, hey, it's time for a commercial break. We'll look oh, at cool. more of the stuff when we get back. Six, five, four. What's that, 45 three, minutes? Two, Max Pratt. One. After these messages, we'll be right back. Dance, Holy. Dance. Live TV dance party. First Friday of each month, 8 p.m. to 9 p.m. TCTV Studio A. 440 Yager Way. Oh, yeah. Brown Interior Limited presents Private Memories, the new Skrill Meadow album for 2014. Featuring the song, Safe Bug. Work with what you got. Did he pay to put this on? Is he, is he sponsored or just shout out to the homies? How do you get a commercial? The idea. Just give us a commercial. We'll put it on. Coming up tomorrow on the program. Your daily hour with me. Yeah. Hey, everybody. Hey. I'm back. I escaped the grasps of sickness. We uh, kicked off Convenience Week. We talked about convenience stores and talked to some convenience stores. Yeah, so what time are they? We said, what time is it? Ask him about hot hey, dogs. Hey, Dan, what time is it? What time is it right now? Yeah. 8.20. Eight, eight hey, thanks. 11.30 to a.m. on TCTV Channel 22. Check it out. Check it out. Uh, what? I don't even know. Mardi Gras week. Yeah. <laughs> hey, we're back from the uh, commercial break. Did you guys have a good commercial break? Did you get a snack? Did you use the restroom? Did you take a walk? Did you sit diligently watching the commercials? Mm-hmm. Get a snack. Hi, Tuna, again. Shout out. Snacks, Hi, Tuna. Yeah. yeah. That's good. Hey, should we keep looking at your video? Sure. Yeah. This, this is a... The Prince? Prince Core, wow. Somebody drew on it. Rolling mm -hmm. Sun. That's a great work of art. Did someone make that? Is that for the show? I think so. I think they put a lot of stuff up on the walls. For it seems like it would have a uh, thing, though. Oh, somebody this was the somebody put all these clay figures, and they put them like on the stairs, and they slowly got destroyed over the night because they were kind of put precariously in places. I don't know if that was like a plan, or if mm -hmm. they're gonna be it like was. everybody it stepped on my stuff. There was there was That's a written cool. description for it. I think. Oh, I think for it, it to Joanne's, get right, Joanna? Yeah, I think so. The plan was for them to get destroyed over the night. Yeah, the, did they it get destroyed too much as of now? I mean, they eventually yeah, this was did. Yeah, a little though. earlier on. All of them. Really some did. of them got more destroyed towards the end of the night. This one. But yeah, the one I think this one at the bottom of the stairs was uh, intentionally placed under that boot. Mm. Yeah, definitely. It's like that. Very narrative. Mm -hmm. What was the description of it? Oh, what? No. This one was very interesting, I thought. It's like uh, online dating profiles. Yeah. It's you know, a, they bring in the, the internet to the real first world. First thing people notice about me looking There was for some of that stuff. I think uh, that the theme of love, of modern love, is a lot, has a lot to do with you know texting and uh, modern communication styles that are Art different. And politics. Yeah. Coincide. This was a pretty gross uh, one. You see this? I, I got some good footage of this. Yeah, one. yeah, yeah. The actual. Ooh, wow! I didn't mm -hmm. know there was so much. It is starting dripping blood. Yeah, there was an actual pumping yeah. system yeah. doing this thing, and it was. Your camera picks up. Do you have a really good camera, Ernest? It seems mm -hmm. like it picks up a lot of. It's a good camera. A lot of good yeah, it's, I've had it for over two years now. It's been. A good, very sturdy camera. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> it's you. Shout out to Sean the guy. Jay! Man, I look, uh... 
There's the full moon. It was a full moon last night, too. That was pretty cool, I thought. Mm. You know, yeah, that's, full moon, that's Valentine's beautiful. Day. How often does that happen? Yeah, you know? that's, that's beautiful. <clears throat> this is such a cool cat. How long were you guys there, then? If it started at 6, you guys were there for like 6 hours? Yeah. Cool. 4, 5, yeah. Hey, let's call uh, uh, Freddy the Producer. Me. We can watch, keep yeah. watching this stuff while we call Freddy the Producer. There's Richard. That was a beautiful thing. Yeah, Richard Nixon looks like his wife, like very, both looking very beautiful and young and happy. Oh, what's his wife's name? I'm trying to remember. There's a good Nixon movie, I think, uh, Oliver Stone yeah, did a Nixon movie. Yeah, that is was, a good one. It was really good. With Anthony Hopkins. Uh -huh. Hey, hey is, is David Weinberg, y'all. Hey, hey! We got sound? Uh, it should, yeah. Where? Did you plug it in there anymore? In through here. Oh, that's not plugged in. We gotta hear it. Why don't you hit pause? <laughs> Why don't you hit oh, pause there and then we can get the sound going. <laughs> Yo. Um, uh, can you find another RCA cable? Uh, or, yeah, we can. Hey, program. Hey, Freddy, how you doing? Oh, oh, wait, 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 hold on. Work, what? Okay, yeah, what? Oh, I was, uh, I'm to DC tomorrow, and I've been doing such a good job of been avoiding, uh, getting sick, avoiding people maybe that were sick, and now I got something. I woke up this morning feeling kind of crappy and then had to go to DC TV and teach a class, but it all went good. Um, I'm almost all ready to go to DC tomorrow. I have the production end loaded up into the car, so I think I'm going to um, bring that over to you. Today? Yeah, if that works. Yeah, that does. We'll be out of here in about 20 minutes so, or 10 minutes. Okay, cool. Well, uh, well I can meet you. I'm, I might be able to meet you guys there or, or somewhere else, but... Um, can can yeah. you can you take a picture of That's the? Uh, going on this I want to see a picture of the Lincoln Memorial. I think they do. They have White Castles there. Have you ever been to oh, DC? Right. Yes, I have. Hey, Freddie, I'm on the program. Hey, hello. Hey, have you ever been to that? Washington D.C.? No, never. But I'm oh. about to. It, very exciting. Do they have White Castles? Yeah. Uh, they won't have much White Castle. It's not quite southern. Enough. They might actually. I, I didn't see one. Are you gonna go to the mall? Are you gonna go to the Capitol Mall? Yeah, I figure we'll do that yeah, one of the days. That will be a fun. Want to check out the Arboretum too? There's a lot of trees and stuff, and we might even go to New York and whatnot. You oh, know? awesome! Did you ever play Cruising USA? Yeah, I did. Yeah, I did at the arcade. The final, the final level of that game is is the Washington D.C. And oh, there's, cool. there's a big part where you're driving through, and there's all these cherry blossoms on the sides of the roads. I don't know if that's real. Huh. Well, it might not quite be time for cherry blossoms, but I'll keep my eye out. That sounds pretty. Uh, where does it end? That uh, cruising USA. Like what's the it, last it, level? The last level is DC. I know what's like the last scene. Like what's the actual finish line? The it's the White, White House. House. Oh, the White House. that's yeah. amazing! Why you not? arrive. You arrive at the White House and oh then my God. all these you know like bikini babes. <laughs> oh, do they have they a come, montage? They yes. come out and they boxes and they of cigars. They have, they have their uh, their flags and and they say you did it. Kind of you know <laughs> hold yeah. the wow. flags and they and it's like kind of two D bikini girl dancing. Yeah. <laughs> How's the production end going? It's going good. Let's see. Uh, we're scheduled out through, uh, I think, maybe, let me look here, Friday or Thursday, maybe. Oh, I think we're scheduled out through Wednesday of next week. That's not quite as much as I thought, but, uh, well, yeah, so we've got, we've got up to the 12th. No, no, I'm sorry. The uh, 19th, that's the last day that we have scheduled on TV right now. It's like 11.30, so that's episode 1243 on the 19th. Um, I've got everything captured up to today's episode, so I was even able to capture last night's, uh, yesterday's awesome uh, art show thing, which good job to everybody. Good job, artists. 
Bird, you got it too far yeah. somehow. That's correct. Yeah. yeah great. We made the transfer. Uh, it all worked. Do you want to hear some of this stuff? I think let's take a look at this Reed's show from last night a little bit. I think yeah, got, definitely. I think we got some audio going this time. Yeah, that's cool. uh, David Weinberg being a oh. mime ventriloquist Is at it, the same time. I don't hear any audio. Oh, oh, there it is. Uh oh! Uh oh! I don't even know if I can really take this. <laughs> oh is, it, is it hard hard to watch yourself? A little bit. Actually, I can't really even watch this. You want to you want to turn it off? All right. Well, that's a good. Uh, here. Okay. <laughs> It was a really, that's a really fun act. It's to watch it is a little bit surreal. It's time for the final dice game. Oh, okay. Oh, real day. I'm glad I made it for the dice game. Yeah, here we go. Um, where's the, where's uh. the camera? Here it is. Are you have any plans in New York, Freddy? Do you know what you're going to do in New York? Um, you see the uh, I don't know. I'll probably look at all the advertisements. <laughs> and um, what I don't know. I'm not sure what's in New York. I guess I'm probably gonna go to Dunkin' Donuts. And I hear there's a Burger King where you you can sit in cars, like the seats are cars. And then another oh, thing. Does he? Did he say that? What number do you want, Freddie? Six, please. All right, here we go. And then I'm gonna eat what pizza what was it? at one two, of the two, famous three. pizza two, two, places, three. and then I'm gonna get what? It was two two three. So who won? Uh, I got oh. one. I think I won with a 400. Actually, did you get? Mm. No, yeah. I got a one with yeah. a three. Uh, You've never so been to Dunkin' Donuts, Freddy? We got a tie. I think. Uh, no, I think. Uh, I don't know. Three, yeah. Maybe I have. I I don't think I have though. But I'm you want to go to you want to go to a Dunkin' Donuts? Yeah, that sounds Ooh. good. It's a tie between Bird and Reed. I heard they have good coffee there, or maybe not good coffee, but. Pretty good coffee. Uh, they have stoic. Um, it's honorable stoic coffee. It's not too good, but it's fa it's famous at least. Though. Yeah. You guys, uh, um, oh, what's, you guys want to share or battle for the win there? I'd God share. What do you think, Bird? Share. Yeah. Bird wants to share too. Great, we're sharing. This is the studio through a different camera. Whoa, look at that feedback. Real feedback. Uh, you still oh. making tunes, Kenny? Uh, yeah, yeah. We're working on the next album. We're putting it out there. I'm making some other stuff too. Oh, Hot Rush? Mm-hmm. Wow, who's in it these days? Uh, it's me and Jeremy and Sp well, Spencer's playing the bass for us right now. Uh, Spencer Salt. Uh, but yeah, okay, he's, yep. he's a guy there. But we're it's kind of uh. I would, I would say me and Jeremy are the core members, and then we have guests play other instruments and stuff, too. Awesome. Yeah, I think, Freddie, did you make it under the album? I'm not sure if any of your recordings made it under the album. I think I might be on one, one song there, possibly. Yeah, yeah. Um, great. Well, have you seen anything yeah. on, the, have you, on the news or on the streets? Uh, no, people are watching the Olympics, I think. Oh, That's yeah, the Olympics. Are you guys watching the Olympics? Uh, I watched a little bit of hockey with Dan uh, today, actually, for just a moment. I haven't seen much of it. Lots Nobody has TVs in Olympia. Lots of Olympia, or I mean, uh, lots of Olympic sports in the winter, they don't make sense to me. You know, like, summer Olympics, lots of those things make sense, like racing, running, you know? Mm -hmm. But, like, yeah. losing? Is that how, I mean, that's, that's such a crazy sport. Mm. Like, yeah. yeah. It takes so much to like prep the course. Like they have the who? specific track. Yeah, know? but it doesn't seem fun. I don't think you recreationally lose. It's kind of dangerous. Yeah, how, but yeah. how do you like get into losing? Is like you know like like hey, I want to be a loser and yeah. like you start doing that and then you win and you're like the best loser. It's weird. Yeah, it's uh, <laughs> kind of an esoteric sport. The yeah. biggest loser. Yeah. There's a, a movie about it, right? But uh, what Bubba said. Cool, cool runnings. runnings. Yes. Yeah. The, I guess the Jamaican the team. Thing? The Jamaican team is making a comeback this year too. That's what I hear. Yeah, they're in it. Um. Wait, losing is losing is the same thing then? Uh, losing is like As one person bobsled kind of. Oh, uh, I see. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, okay. 
and it's a lot smaller. It's not like a, it's not like it's you're like in really this big basic. boat thing. It's really the you have to like lift your whole body off the ground. You're like flexed while you're on. The yeah, your cart. your cart is pretty small, and then oh, you're wow. you're going down this crazy thing, and they go like 80 miles an hour apparently. So I like don't even like to do that and in you cars. Have to sometimes you're kind of like you can control with your body. That's my favorite part of the seeing it on TV is watching them count the speeds up. Although yeah. sometimes they like take, they put the speed away. They hide the mm. speed, and then it comes back when they get to the next spot on the track. But I just yeah. wish they could show it all the time. It looks, it's so exciting to see the speed go up and higher and higher. I wonder if there's been any like Olympic deaths doing that kind of thing. It seems like it uh, probably would have happened. I think someone got really hurt on um, either skiing or snowboarding. Yeah, I think someone broke their s spine. Like, like, yeah, really it seems like it neck. could happen. Yeah. They're doing flips and crazy stuff. Mm -hmm. Do you? I'm still trying to figure out curling. That's a big mystery to me. Do you know about? Cur it's like, yeah. I mean, the best way I can describe curling is it, it's you know that shuffleboard game that sometimes is at bars or you know game at the, places. At the Brotherhood. Yeah, it's like shuffleboard, but you are you know huge. It's like human size, and you're tiny, and then you you slide around on the board itself. How much does fun. the curling puck weigh? Yeah, well, the thing is too though that with curling is if you throw it, you there's a person in front that can put water on the ice. So it's a little, it's exactly like shuffleboard, but in the sense that there's a person who puts water on the ice, which controls the speed of it. And then you have uh, to, to hit this tar tar yeah, target. Mm. So it's really they, peculiar they in that sweep, way. Right, too. Yeah, sweeping, that's what it is. Yeah, yeah. Like in it, front of them, yeah. they it create less weird. friction. Yeah. Yeah. yeah they're ma I didn't realize that they were making water. Yeah, that's what they're doing. They're like they making water because they're using friction to make water. That, that explains a lot to me now, actually. Yeah, it's an odd Olympic event. <laughs> I, I don't know. I, I think I like Summer Olympics a little bit better. Oh, definitely. Yeah. I think winter, I mean, <laughs> any winter Olympics, you, I, don't, I don't know how you could possibly get into these sports, you know? Like, it's, you know, in summer, like you're like, I'm going to be a runner, you know? Or I'm play volleyball, you know? That I'm seems gonna natural. I'm going to play volleyball. I'm going to go swim. These things make sense to me, but, like, I'm going to back do backflips on skis and, like... <laughs> this is the first year that they've had wom women doing the jumps, right? I don't know. That's what I saw. Well, I think a lot of the Winter Olympics historically come from, uh, you know, Europe, like Norway, Switzerland does really well. Things that are like really uh, lots of snow there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I think like part of the culture is just like, oh, I will do backflips because I mean, that's what we do. I don't know if mm -hmm. it's like their 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 parents their parents were skiers or something or something, but mm -hmm. I don't know. Oh, also, costs a lot of money to do those sports. Yeah. Like, the ski is like expensive. Who would, but whoever thinks, like, I don't want to do a backflip on a ski. Oh, no. I don't know mm -hmm. who thinks, like, Lift I want expensive. to do a backflip on a, a ski. It's like, wow. Oh, wow. Actually, one minute left. Oh, I was on a team with an uh -oh. Olympian. Oh, it's over? Yeah, well, we have one minute left. We made uh -oh. it through the whole hour. Thanks. Wow, good job, you guys. Thanks. Thanks for being on the show, Reed. It was so great to see you on uh, TV again. The same, Freddie. Have a wonderful time on the East Coast. I will do it's going to be a blast. Cool. So I'm just so I'll be, I'll be home. To... We'll see you there, I guess, in a little bit. Okay, I'll see you very soon. Bye. Oh, can I get Bye. some shout outs? Yeah, this is sound is off. Uh, yeah, sure. Oh, shout out to the world. Shout out to uh, all the children, all the moms, all the dads. Uh, shout out to all the magical elves hiding, all the magical elves that aren't hiding, all the magical elves possessed by spells. All the magical elves that are doing well. All the magical well dad and this. Shout out to Tuna. Stay real. Um, yeah. Thanks, uh, Freddie and Mr. Ginsu and Dan yeah. Doubler. Oh, yeah, and you two for being here. Thanks for reading, Burden. Yeah. My yeah. pleasure. Episode number and date. Thank you, TVs. Yeah. Computers, check out the website. We're on there. I agree. Thanks Facebook and Twitter and YouTube. You can check it out. Special YouTube. Is your video? Phones. Uh, oh no. yeah, Bert. Bert is on. No, no, no. Crew. Reed's on the crew. You guys want to be on the crew? Love it. Thanks TCTV. Thanks to LoveBaby.com. Check it out. Psycho Feeling. Yeah. Jordy E. Fabulous. Thurston County, Washington State, USA. Oh yeah, yesterday. Yesterday was the one year anniversary of meeting Jordan E. Thanks for yours that you're watching. Thank you. 
one year ago, and that time flies. Hell yeah, yes. dog. Remember when we oh, met yeah. Jordy? Yeah. Like, yeah. Wasn't that one? That it was, was one a whole year ago. A whole year ago. Isn't that crazy? That's right. Jordy E is a, a clothing, clothing retailer. Yeah, and you don't go check it out. I 